Hey there. So, they actually did it. I can't believe they named Herta Pro Max as the Herta. It fits her so well, to be honest. Well, actually, in some of the other languages, she is referred to as Big Herta instead. To be honest, there's really nothing big about her. Okay, okay. Before we continue, I need to ask all of you something. Because I can't be the only one that thought this would happen. Let me just draw this out in MS Paint. My expectation was this. Knowing Hoyo, I thought that they would increase her... Um... Weight. Now, in reality, she's more of... This. Look, I'm not trying to be Master Roshi here. Just to be clear, I'm a fan of her current design. Can I just say that she does have a bit of resemblance to Jade? She kind of looks like a mini younger Jade. I guess Air Edition sisters should stick together? Because in my opinion, Air Edition characters typically aren't the most popular. Most players are usually Akron this or Firefly that. The rest are either on Team Da Sisters or Team Good Old Reliable Destruction Buddies. Air Edition typically isn't as well received as the others. So hopefully, this can change with the Herta release. I mean, she is an emanator, right? That's like a telltale sign of a character having an OP kit. So, what do we know about her kit so far? Her preliminary kit has been leaked, but the 3.0 beta hasn't even started yet. As always, do take what I'm about to say with a grain of salt. She will have a transferable stack mechanic similar to Acheron's. In order to get these stacks, she needs to either attack her enemies using her skill, or when the enemies first enter the battle. Her ult is a damage to all enemies, and then it gives her another turn while unlocking her enhanced skill. Her enhanced skill is where her nuke damage is going to coming from. The enhanced skill will have a higher damage multiplier based on how many stacks there are on the field and it will deal more damage if there are more air edition characters on the team. The fun part of all this is that her enhanced skill hits like a billion times. First, it does a single target attack and applies a stack. Then it does another single target attack plus damage to the adjacent enemies. Finally, it does damage to all enemies. My initial thoughts on her kit is that she doesn't feel like an erudition character. She feels more like a beefed up destruction character. Dare I say, kind of like Jing Liu in the prime of the meta. Anyways, we will have to wait until 3.0 beta for a more accurate read on her kit. But so far, her future looks bright. Speaking of the future, I do wonder which 4 star will get their 5 star variants. If I had to guess, it would be Sampo, right? It's about time for the masked fools to start interacting more with the Astro Express. So timing wise and lore wise, he should be next in line to get a 5 star version of himself. Who do you think is going to get the next 5 star variation? But yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Okay, bye.